we're reacting to the history of the Dream SMP oversimplified. Let's go. The Dream SMP is a Minecraft survival server and nobody understands it, so I'm here to help. In the beginning, <laughs> Dream fair. created the heavens and the earth, or actually, Minecraft did it for him. He invited lots of people to come play with him and they built some stuff together, taking a few breaks to go fishing. Dream I mean, that's how I feel. I'm always like, guys, Dream legitimately feels like a god in this universe. Absolutely. Underground, Ponk lived with the chickens, and Sapnap and Alyssa built houses by the lake. What? Also, bad boy Halo happened at some point. Mobs murder Dream's horse, Dream and Sapnap murder George, and Sapnap murders Halo's pet fish, which makes him very sad, so he quits. Will you come back <laughs> if we give you more fish? Uh, yeah, okay, I guess. George steals Sapnap's horse, and Sapnap kills his own horse trying to hit George. So what? they sue each other, and surprise, Sapnap wins, and George is sentenced to death. Sapnap might join him if he feels like it. Then Tommy Anna joins him. <laughs> hey, can I invite some friends? Sure, go ahead. Oh. He then commits multiple murders and Tommy's domestic. that friend that you invite to the party and then he rolls up with 20 boys. You're like, hey, can you come? Can I come? Yeah, yeah, sick, man. Come on. It's fine. It's like a small get together. Three of us are hanging in an intimate gathering. Tommy's like, sick, I'll be right over. Knock, knock. Hey, who's that? Oh, Tommy said I could come. Oh, who's behind you? The other 19 people his ass invited. Terrorism attacks before tunneling into a hill. He also steals some of Punk's Jeez. land and kills his chickens. I'm sure that won't backfire on him or anything. <laughs> Puns and Tubbo build houses by Dream's bridge. Fundy hides in a cave and Purple becomes an alien. Dream is trying to listen an to some alien? music, but all the best songs belong to Tommy in it, who just killed Alyssa because Alyssa burned down Sapnap's house because Sapnap burned down Punk's lemon tree because Punk, well, actually, there's no reason. Sapnap is just a massive pyromaniac and Punk is getting really sick of being bullied by every player in the server except Puns and Tubbo. Those guys were angels. And they Dream is friends with Punk and Alyssa. So you know what that means. Dream should steal the discs, which he wanted to do anyway. So while everybody else was busy committing various acts of arson and murder, he snuck into Tommy's base and stole both the discs. Yeah, Tommy what's up with Minecraft YouTubers also being low-key secret py pyromaniacs, huh? Why are they all pyromaniacs as well? Found out almost immediately. Like, they're not serial killers, they don't get into other petty crimes, they just do pyromancy, like, all off the get. And teamed up with Sapnap and Tubbo to get them back, but failed. In the meantime, Fundy logged on with plans to kill Dream on sight, but when Dream was nowhere to be found, he decided to kill Tubbo instead. What? He tried drowning Tubbo while he was eating pizza, but Purple <laughs> discovered him before running away, giving Tubbo just enough time to break out of the trap. But Fundy killed him anyway, and then moved on to Purple because he wanted to test his cool new shovel. Purple beat up Fundy, then Fundy beat up Tubbo, then Purple beat up Fundy again, then Tubbo and a Creeper accidentally beat up Purple's redstone machine, then Purple beat up Fundy a third time before they all talked it out in the new socializing club. Oh, and Tom- Boys, this is more complicated than Final Fantasy. The lore for the Dream SMP is so wild, it legitimately sounds more complicated than when people are trying to give you like an in-depth explanation of what started World War One and all the secret alliances that were going on. Like, this is some Franz Ferdinand ass shit going on, man. Tommy was there. He set the club on fire. They all agreed to truce if Fundy gave Tubbo back his stolen pickaxe, so they went out into the forest to find it. it Fundy wasted their time until Purple started trying to kill him, so he told Tubbo where it was actually hidden. Tubbo took the pickaxe back and then joined Purple to kill Fundy, while Tommy joined the call and immediately left because it was too- <laughs> He still wanted to help Tubbo though, so he followed them and ended up killing Purple in confusion. See, Fundy stole the items and broke the truce when he killed Purple and refused to give the items back. Purple was no match for him without his gear, so he decided to fight the battle another day. Tubbo went to help Tommy steal his discs back by using an x-ray glitch to find Dream's secret base. They failed to find the discs and decided to just trade away the chest plate, with Tommy stashing them away safely in his ender chest. Then everybody decided to stop killing each other for a little while, and they became peaceful farmers for a day or two, until Purple built a trap in the socializing club for Fundy, and accidentally killed himself, Tommy, and Dream in the process. <laughs> a bunch of bees die, and- Aw, oh, don't you hate when you're just pranking the boys and you accidentally kill all six of you? You accidentally killed the whole squad because you were just trying to prank one of your homies. Where an era joined the server. I'm sure that won't cause any drama. Dream commits <laughs> genocide against Tubbo's villagers, causing hey, him to Gaff? relocate to a jungle base above the nether. Wilbur decided he wanted to be rich, so he started a drug empire with Tommy <laughs> until Sapnap found out and tried to have them arrested. I screw think this, this was my you. favorite part. When Wilbur and Tommy become Breaking Bad meth dealers, I think that might have been my favorite arc, to be honest. Do I have a right to sell drugs? I'm making a new nation. So all the Europeans got together and formed Lemanberg. All the libertarians be like, ha! Ah. do that, we own everything. And challenged them to war. Lemanberg fought many battles, some of which they they almost didn't lose, until Dream got bored and blew up the entire city. Dude, leave us alone. Will you leave us alone if I give you my music discs? Okay, thanks.
Jack-Manic spy. So they continued their drug empire, inviting Jack Manifold, Crackety, and Nikki into the city, while Skeppy hid away from everybody else and also maybe traded a dead horse for Tommy's cat disc. Speaking of horses, Tommy's horse is dead, and so is Tommy, and Tubbo, and Dream. Purple and Jack attempt to establish capitalism and fail, while Dream, Tommy, Quackity, and Tubbo are busy asking for Twitch subscriptions. Hey, you could make a religion out of this. Sapnap decided to kill everybody's pets until they got mad enough to kill his pets until he got mad enough to declare war and massacre nearly every animal on the server. Sheesh. Hey, you can make a religion out of- No, Dude, don't. Evan Carl MC Jacob Gaming really cut out a lot of animal cruelty in his videos, huh? Just joined some PETA needs to get on this server. We need some animal rights activists. In between, he collected music discs and built a pizza parlor like the saint he is. Why are, you throwing, why are you throwing paint on the Kardashians, PETA? You really need to get into the S&P and save these chickens. Who should rule over Lamanberg? Usually it would be Wilbur since he was the founder, but the parties of Swag, Schlatt, and Coconut decided they wanted to try too. Surprise, <laughs> Schlatt and Quackity both win, and they immediately exile Wilbur and Tommy. If, if, hey, if you're not Schlatt for president, if you don't embrace Schlatt as your overlord, what are you even doing? What are you even doing? Who are you? Schlatt? for Supreme Dictator of the Universe, absolutely. Kid, and decides to become the Mr. Miyagi of Dream SMP, Sheesh. mentoring the two in Pogtopia until they become strong enough to reclaim their homeland. Techno the is a king. In the entire universe hates Schlatt, Schlatt is on life support, and man <laughs> gets taxes. Then nothing That's happens my president. Abuse, except demons and animal abuse. Nothing Whoa. unusual. So Whoa. to make everybody angry again, Schlatt hosts the Manberg Festival, and everyone's ready to kill him. But he was already suspicious of his right-hand man, Tubbo, and asked Technoblade to publicly execute him in front of the crowd. Techno agreed, then killed Schlatt, Quackity, and half of the crowd, sending the entire <laughs> server into chaos. Manberg still hates itself, Pogtopia started hating itself, and everybody else hates both of them, eventually teaming up to create the Badlands. I have a Tommy question for you guys. Who's Abby? Whose skin do you think is the best? Dream SMP favorite skin in the comments in the chat. I want you guys to sound off. Whose skin do you think is the coolest? Uh, for me, I like Schlatt's and Bad Boy Halos. I think those are the sickest on the server. What? Whose skins do you guys think are the best? In chat and comments, let me know. He travels back to Manberg with the intention of assassinating Techno Blades is leaders, cool too. but Quackity was so mad at Schlatt's disrespect that he killed him, resigned, and joined up with Pogtopia. <laughs> also, Wilbur went insane and tried to blow up Manberg. Twice. Yeah, Schlatt Wilbur ends up dead after wild. trying to attack Tommy and Quackity, Wilbur discovers his explosives have been destroyed, Dream reveals there's an imposter among them, and the war begins. Hey. Octopia and the Badlands meet at a large stick and have a tea party while discussing how much Manberg sucks, and a bridge is built between the two kingdoms to help them destroy each other. Carl and Sapnap ignore the war and create the <laughs> little I just love this picture of Carl. <laughs> Was centered around bagels and rutabagas, shortly what? before changing their mind and joining up with Dream and Schlatt. <laughs> Huns duels George over a firework until he climbs up a tree, then George duels Sapnap till they're separated, then Sapnap duels Tommy until both their pets are dead. Is it wartime yet? I think it's wartime. Everybody I feel needs like this to is a pretty accurate recreation of what the aristocracy was like in like the 1700s. Like if you read history from that time, it's just like, oh yeah, this guy's dueling this guy, they're dueling this guy, he died in a duel, he died in a duel. Like major political decisions were happening based on all these duels. Whether they support the rebellion or whether they support not supporting it. Surprise, most of the world supports it and they win. <laughs> Not sure about Manberg though, looks pretty messy over there. <laughs> now that that's over, Lamanberg rebuilds, Mexican Lamanberg copies their idea, Era overthrows George and becomes king, and Tommy's exiled for disturbing the peace. For a little while, everything was calm again. Homes, restaurants, casinos, towers, and bridges were built, and new faces tore the land during the ceasefire. Somebody found an egg in their base, I'm sure that won't cause any problems. What? Mexican Lamanberg was blown up before being turned into El Rapids, Australia just became itself, Gogtopio simultaneously became itself and killed itself, Tommy wants to kill himself but Dream beats him to it, and everybody wants to kill Technoblade, so they do. You've got mail. It's from Technoblade. Hey, what's up, he found you living under his house and asks you to be his friend. This message also got forwarded to Filza. They all decided to be friends because they had so much in common. <laughs> Meanwhile, money. Manberg holds a festival which is secretly an assassination plot against Dream, but Dream destroys the community house and frames Tommy, who denies it and flames Tubbo before apologizing and betraying Techno by switching sides, with Techno then leaving with Dream, who now had both music discs and therefore all the power he needed to destroy Manberg. Honestly, Boys in the Dream SMP server switch alliances like a like like they're damn Nintendo, bro. Seriously, they are out here. There's like switch, 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 switch. Like seriously, sheesh. Good. After several days of chaos, they return with Filza and an army of hounds, and the fighting begins. Withers destroy the players. TNT rains from the sky to destroy the land, and Tekken is so there to clean up what's left behind. When it was all over, everybody split apart and made some cities and other stuff. 
Ram Snow before gets who he is, is Ghostbird takes a vacation to Purgatory, and Tubbo makes a small team dedicated to taking down Dream, and producing enough nukes to destroy the universe if they fail. <laughs> Surprise, they succeed, and Dream dies twice before being thrown into Pandora's vault. Wouldn't it be nice to control the world which right now are puppets with no one controlling them? The Egg Empire, or Eggpire for short, wants to gain control, but Eret stops them and says, Wait, no, you can't do that, I'm the king, I have all the power. <laughs> and the Eggpire said, How about I do anyway? Guys, I have a question. <laughs> what is, um... Who's the Josephine in this story? There's been a distinct lack of Josephine. Like, I just want to know, where's Josephine? And the Eggpire invaded more and more and more and more and more of the world, and was planning to invade the entire SMP. Tommy decided to visit Dream in prison to talk about life, but there was a security breach and Tommy got locked inside with Dream while they waited. This while they so were trapped trippy. together, Tommy annoyed and argued with Dream until they got in a fistfight, permanently killing him. This makes a lot of people sad, so they build some statues and shrines to honor his legacy. Jack takes over Tommy's old hotel to try to gain power, while the Eggpire <laughs> actually does. They make Puffy mad in the process though, so she joins Technoblade's team and they become the Syndicate and become more and more powerful. Wilbur and Tommy the briefly syndicate? debate how cool it is to be dead before Dream resurrects Tommy to prove he could, promising to revive Wilbur to create chaos. They remain trapped together for nearly a week until Sam returns and rescues Tommy, now discovering the world covered in blood vines and his home stolen by Jack Manifold. Schlatt decided he wanted to make a return as well, so he asked Quackity to steal Dream's book of resurrection, which he has yet to do. The world is covered in blood, the dead are coming back to life, everybody hates everybody else, and we're all gonna die. Bye. What? What? That was insane! <laughs> the world is covered in bl <laughs> blood, the dead are coming back to life, everybody hates everybody else, and we're all gonna die. That was nuts, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Honestly, I wish... I, I couldn't follow. <laughs> it's crazy when you get the Evan MC Gaming version of the story, which is so... I mean, it's very linear, right? It's relatively easy to follow. And then you get the full version, and you're just like... Man, Evan, you cut out a lot, but I feel like you need to. I feel like you absolutely needed to. That being said, guys, make sure you subscribe down below for more reactions and comment. Let me know what other videos you want to see reactions to. I'm Wesley. Join us on twitch.tv slash talk to Wesley to do the reactions. Join us live. It's a ton of fun. Have a beautiful day. I'm...